Hello everybody and welcome back to more Let's Play Pikmin. Last time, we got all the ship parts that we can possibly get in the uh, Force of Hope for the time being, which is honestly pretty surprising that I was actually able to do that, honestly. Was not suspected to be able to do that, but we completed the Force of Hope for the time being that we could possibly do at this point. And today, guys, today, we are not going to be heading to the Impact Site. We're actually going to be heading over to the Force Naval. Which is our next new area. Yes, indeed. The Forest Naval. It sounds like you're heading over to like a naval base or something. At least that's what it sounds like to me. So yes, here is the Forest Naval. Looks like we're going to be dealing with uh, quite a bit of uh, water, if I do say so myself. So funny enough, I'm actually not going to go ahead and collect that water, collect my Pikmin quite yet. Instead, I'm going to be going down over here because... Right over here is our next new Pikmin uh, type. Yes, I'm just I'm just gonna go right over there, no beating around the bush, heading right there and collecting our third and final type of Pikmin in this game, which, as you can tell, can work in water. Nice. And gee, I wonder what type of Pikmin it's going to be. Hmm, I cannot tell the color. Yes, there it is. There is blue Pikmin. It, with the, I know this is supposed to be gills on his face, but it kind of looks like he's just going, oh, with that face. It is a Pikmin of yet another color. Near this one's cheeks is what appears to be a set of gills. This trait suggests to be more... This, tra bleh, this trait suggests to me that this blue type of Pikmin can enter the water without any trouble whatsoever. There's only one way to find out. I will use A to hold and yada yada yada. So with blue Pikmin, they can actually traverse on water. They're also the most average uh, Pikmin of the bunch, so they can actually do decent damage enough and have moderate um, uh, stamina. So yes, these are kind of like the middle class Pikmin, if you will. So yes, like I said, yellow's not so totally useful, but they will be useful at a later time. Uh, that was a new enemy that we just uh, saw right there. That is called a bread bug. Uh, yes, that is seriously what they were called. Uh, don't tell me more about that, honestly. Um, yes. I'm gonna go ahead and collect those. And might as well go ahead and then collect uh, those Pikmin over there. Have them attack. Attack with all you can, my Pikmin friends. There you go. One for each of you. Or, okay, that also works too. You know, I'm totally fine with that. I'm totally fine with that, getting a nice uh, battalion of blue Pikmin sorted out here. It's basically what I want the majority of this day to be, is raising up battalions for my uh, Pikmin. That way I can get through the naval base. Not the naval base, the forest naval is what I was trying to say. Get him, get him, get him. <laughs> beat that bread bug, beat that bread bug, because yes, bread bug can actually take items from you, which is uh, not a very good thing to have. Uh, this is basically how you defeat bread bugs in some cases. Uh, you just have them go up there and then boink! And yep, they are... Oh, okay, I guess they're not gonna go that way. Fine then, I... I see how it is. Come on, come on. Okay, I guess they're not gonna be going over to that one. I was gonna see if I could try to defeat them, but yes. If they, uh, collect any items, then they will, uh, take them to the base. So, let's say you're trying to get, like, a, a ship part or a pallet or whatever. They can carry those to their base, wherever their base is. I've never been able to figure that out because I always defeat them before I can find their base. Their base of operations, I say. It's like a whole bunch of uh, Pikmin over here. And now we're going to be sprouting five more, it seems. Yes! Or at least an additional Pikmin, it seems. Four and five. <laughs> Spectacular, even amazing, astounding, great. Okay. So now what we're gonna be going over here doing is finding uh, places that have their sprouts pointed up, which they haven't done that yet. As it seems, I am honestly quite disappointed in that, my friends. What a shame. Uh, what we do need to do is find some grass, if I can find any. Uh, come on, grass. Where's some grass? Aha! There's some grass! I'm gonna 
be able to spread up these Pikmin just a little bit better because there's actually a ship part nearby, uh, right over there, actually, so we can easily grab that if we uh, so choose. Uh, so yeah, naval base, not the naval base, the force naval is pretty massive. I don't know why I keep calling it the naval base, probably because it sounds like military in a way. It's the forest naval. That's what it's called. It's called the forest naval. Come on. We're not going to get all our Pikmin up. Ah, come on. Looks like we got uh, one stray blue right there. Nice. That's exactly what I wanted to see. Uh, let's see how many Pikmin that actually uh, uh, takes over there. See, that's our uh, next ship part right over there. It requires a certain amount, probably. Oh, great bomb rocks there, too. Nice. I found my number one Inodium jet. Unfortunately, this puts us slightly out a slightly odiferous exhaust, but it does propel me to escape velocity in an instant. This stench is a small price to pay for such performance. Yeah, so we're collecting used parts apparently now. Oh, I am one short! Of course they would do that to me. Of freaking course. Well, these guys haven't uh, fully sprouted yet. Oh, hey, no, never mind. They did fully sprout. Uh, what's going on? There we go. Guess these uh, blue Pikmin were just stuck there for a minute. Uh, these here are little uh, things that can actually break open if you want to. The Pikmin their care ball seems to be laying out one place. Oh, okay. Okay, I see what's going on here. Come on, get up. What is uh, going on here? Why are you guys having problems? Oh, it's because he can't... He cannot carry those stuff yet. Okay, so I might as well go ahead and do that. Might as well spread up those other Pikmins and maybe, hopefully, we can... I can't get up there. Nice. Yeah, this is, uh... This is spectacular pro commentary that we have going on right here. Now, don't we? Don't we, guys? Fantastic. I have no idea why they couldn't just, like, you know... Uh, gone down over here, you know? Women just as simple as that, right? Okay, fine. Just uh, bang your head if you so want to. So, like, I don't know why they just can't, like, crawl down over there. I don't understand why. That's very bizarre to me, but hey, come on. Dude. Dude, why are you going this way? Okay, fine. You guys are just being morons here. Okay, blue. Go over there. Thank you. Jeez. Ah, oh, nothing can seem to be going my way, it seems. Oh, hey, bread bug. Bread bug, bread bug, bread bug, bread bug. Bread bug. Let's see what we got. Actually, I'm going to see what what does. Uh, it is unsure what... Okay. Okay. I will uh, be thankful for that. Guys, stop. Guys. Stop with that. Just go and help them. Jeez. <sighs> this is just fantastic commentary that I have going on over here. I'm sorry that this does not sound like exciting or any stretch of the imagination at all. Let's just go ahead and... I don't know. We'll just bring out a whole bunch of reds for right now. Get these guys going. Come on, come on, come on. Out you go, out you go. We gotta go help our new newfound friends over here. If these guys going, it's already midway through the day, so already uh, we're wasting a whole bunch of time. We haven't gotten a single ship part from this. So, um, yay. I have no one else was to say about this. It's just that the Forest Naval, I'm gonna be straight with you, it's not my favorite area. It's probably my least favorite from uh, this Pikmin game and probably my least favorite of the Pikmin series in total. It's just... Kind of laid back, kind of boring, nothing exciting other than just watching Pikmin hump walls while trying to destroy them. Just get their sexy game on, I guess. And good, there we go. Now we've gotten that taken care of. We can go ahead and destroy some... Dudes! Get over here! Ah, God, these guys are just so stupid sometimes, you know what I mean? Alright. Go ahead and do that. I'll have these guys work on that for the time being. And we got some black walls right over there. Awesome. 
Uh, we're gonna take our Pikmin over here. Take down this bridge. As fast as we can. Looks like they're almost done with that, which is nice. Awesome. I like seeing that. Now we're making just just a little bit of progress. I actually just want to make a path just a little bit, just to be able to actually, you know, have them do stuff. Because doing stuff is an important uh, feat that we have to do. Uh, guys, are you almost done? Okay, good. Down over here. I uh, kind of can see just a little bit of what we have to do here. Uh, right over here is something actually pretty cool. It's a candy pop bud. Uh, we can't do anything with that quite yet at the time being, but we will uh, later, I guess. Uh, over there is actually a boss that actually yields uh, one of the uh, uh, ship parts that we need to go ahead and collect. And right now, I have to go all the way around. Uh, over there is another enemy. These are fiery blow hogs. Uh, they. Uh, can't hurt red Pikmin because uh, red Pikmin are immune to fires. So that's pretty nice. We're just going around to do some exploring and see what we can find, which is, you know, always a blessing that we can do. Um, actually, I think I'm gonna go ahead and dismiss my uh, red Pikmin over here. Come on, come on, come on, guys, guys, wake up! Thank you. And we're just gonna go ahead and uh, tackle this blow hog. Look at it go! Whoosh! Oh my god! Whoa, that is some, uh, burning loins, I have to say there. Come on. Attack it again. Attack it again. Attack it again. There we go. Good. Good blowhog. There we go. Now we're making just... We're making some progress. We're making some progress, I guess. Okay, bright bug, you can go ahead and take that. I don't care. Come on. Take that down. Whoa! That did some damage over there. Yes, if you ever take damage as Almar, uh, you can just go back to your ship and you can restore some health. Just go into the pod where you, the Pikmin would normally take your parts at- Oh, oh, whoa, oh, hey! That was, uh, interesting. It just faded away like that. That was odd. And, oh, over there! That's an enemy I personally do not like at all. Oh, uh, those things are called, uh, wall -wogs. We'll get into the wall -wogs in a little bit. But fiery blow hugs right now, they are pretty easy at the time being. Come on. Take them out. Take them out. Oh, another iridescent flip field. Nice. Come on. Come on. You out. Come on, 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 come on. Ah! You're so close. You're so close to victory, my friends. Come on. Awesome. Take that down. And uh, I'd rather not go anywhere near that uh, Wally Wog uh, just yet. Guys, get over here. Jesus. Can't you guys listen? Can't you guys listen? Whoa! That's crazy. That was funky. I do like my funkiness. I do like to get nice and funky! Whoa! They just go right up in the air. Alright, come on. Wow, we are now at half health. That, they do quite a bit of damage, don't they? Come on. Come on. Take him down. Take him down. Take him down. Yes, thank you. Awesome. Really appreciate that. Where is that red Pikmin going? Guys, come on. We got important things to do here. Okay, I guess you guys are gonna go that way, apparently. Okay, that's fine. That's totally fine with me. It's, it's gonna be taking a while for us to actually get our uh, blue Pikmin numbers up just a little bit. So, maybe by us being able to do this, we can actually move the Pikmin pellets, uh, the Pikmin ship, just a little bit closer to the ship. Not the ship, the onion. That's what I'm trying to say. Where is that blue red Pikmin going? All right, come on, guys. There we go. Awesome. Bring these guys over to here so that way they can help with uh, dealing with that uh, bridge. Make some progress. Probably not going to get into any uh, fighting going on here else. Or not collecting a single ship part, it seems, because I wanted to be able to. But I guess, you know, that's just not how the cookie crumbles today. Because, you know, like I said, I really don't hate the Forest Naval. What is your guys' uh, least favorite uh, level on Pikmin? I'm curious, because mine is the Forest Naval, obviously. Um... It's just kind of boring and bland, whereas the other one is just, like, nice, somber, relaxing just a little bit. Um, where? Guys, come on. Just leave those alone, please. We're just trying to explore. See what we can do here. That's what I'm here to do. Here to explore. See what we can do. And go on an adventure. With our friends. 
Enjoy times. Alright, that there is another blocked area, which we're gonna need a lot of equipment to be able to do that. And ah! Here is the introduction of Shearwigs! Uh, Shearwigs, like I said, they, they can actually fly. When they reach a certain amount of health, they will fly up to regain health. But if they're over water, they, uh... They, uh... Uh, do stuff. They will actually uh, just, uh, die. <laughs> because they can't, uh, survive in water, so, yeah. That was a very unproductive, uh, video, I will say. I'm sorry for the lack of work going on around there. It's just that I really don't like the forest naval. I get so confused of what it is that I need to do, so... Obviously, I'm just going to take some time to regroup a little bit, work out what it is that I want to do, and go from there, alright? It's only the fourth day, so we don't have to worry about that too much. We got plenty of time, so, yeah. And, ah, oh, even worse, we lost the blue Pikmin. Great. Great. And even worse, we lost that to a Wally Wog. Alright, four days since impact. Deep in the cave I discovered in the forest, I encountered blue Pikmin. These blue fellows have something resembling gills on their cheeks, and they appear to be amphibious, surviving both in water and on land. The wonders of nature never cease to stun me, even in this alien land. Now, it's kind of cool to seeing Olimar that like, likes to explore a little bit. We left behind five? Wow, damn. And we only lost three in battle, so that's okay-ish, I guess. But, man, losing all that... Losing at least a blue Pikmin. It's kind of a shame. Oh well. At least we tried. At least we tried. So here's hoping that day five will be just a little bit more productive. Hopefully I can actually gain more from this. But I don't know. I'm not trusting my luck on this. But we can always try. Anyways, with that being said, we are going to end things off here for right now. Like we always do for days. That's how you can tell that I'm cutting off these videos. Is having them be set out to days. So with that being said... Next time on Let's Play Pikmin, we are going to be heading back into the Forest Naval and hopefully, maybe this time, be able to do some progress like we did back in the uh, Forest of Hope. So, yeah, here's hoping we could do something like that. Anyways, with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll catch you next time for more Pikmin. Bye!